All right, so we have this video here for you guys, but we did not know that Perfect Game was going to ban the high fire, and this video has been filmed for a good while now. But if you guys want to stay tuned and watch till the end, the results might surprise you. Stay tuned. Oh, just missed the light pole. That was cute. Hey guys, this is Alex from Andre Boys. We're doing a showdown between the Easton Hype Fire and the Rawlings Icon. We've already did a video reviewing these two bats, but today we're, they're going head to head to see which one is the hottest bat on the market right now. I'm going with the draw fives. I have my boy. Jackson Soap around five feet tall, 100 pounds. I play for CBU Hawks and Beachside Blue Goose. So he's going to be swimming the drop eights. So we're going to see in drop five and drop eight which one of these two are hotter. And we have a 320 to center, 300 with a 20 foot fence in left. And we have a 315 to right. So we're gonna hit it and take some cuts with all these and see which one's hotter. You ready? Let's go! First up, we got the drop eight Easton Hype Fire. Oh boy! Thank you. Oh boy, that's a base hit right there. Oh boy, 225 right there. time for the drop it icon and so you can see this icon is straight out of the wrapper no break in this definitely feels a lot lighter than the hype fire Two more barrels with each bat right now. All right, so I have a 32 drop five, high fire. Let's see what this thing can do. That sounded so good. I was off the hands a little bit right there. Oh. That was the sweet spot right there. Oh, <laughs> top of the fangs. A little bit on the end. A little one hopper. I didn't even feel it on the barrel that time. It felt so good. Where'd it go? Over the fence. I absolutely barreled that. That was a rope. Fence. Alright, I found it now. Found my groove. I got that a little bit off the end. Big hurt! Alright, eye contact. Okay. Next up we have 32 drop 5 Rollins Icon. We also got the Vegas Gold Grip and now I'm get you on with the Headbanger Sports website. Okay, okay. Oh my. That was 
off the hands or there's a ball still in. Another dinger on the other field. You know, this one definitely swings a little bit lighter than I fire. Woo, that's a rope right there. Exit below. Oh. That ball's way gone. Onto the other T ball field. Rope. Oh, what was that? I don't know, it shouldn't have spun at it. That was the nastiest curveball ever. Still hit it. Not very good, but hit it. Ah. Oh. Light pull. Oh, just missed the light pull. The ball was way gone. That was jam shot right there. No shot. I was about to say, hold on. That, that ball looked like it was carrying a little bit. Yeah. If I hit this one out, y'all gotta subscribe. Oh yeah, into the tree. Nope. Yep. Dang it, into the tree. You know, I definitely think the icon's a little bit hotter, but I think the high fire is definitely a little more forgiving. Ugh. Yeah. I'm locked in now. <laughs> Way gone. And that's end cap too. Other dugout. All right, so I'm gonna take one more cut with the high fire. And let's just see what the how they compare. Oh, actually go right there. Hold on. That was, that was close to 100. Huh? That was close to 100. Okay. Oh. Not a good bunny back. What? That was a beautiful ball. I mean, cool. All right, there's two more balls. Come on, ball. Alright, so we took some cuts with the East the High Fire and the Rolling Zycon. So what do you think about the drop eights, Jackson? These are both really hot bats. This is definitely way lighter than the High Fire and way more forgiving, way bigger barrel. Felt a little better. The High Fire definitely has a little bit of a bigger barrel on it, but every time you hit the ball, it goes straight to your hands and just doesn't have that good feeling. So overall, my favorite pick would be the Rolling Zycon. See, when it comes to drop fives, I think I'm the opposite. When it comes to which one's hotter, I will have to give it to the Rollins Icon. I think for, as a 13 year old, it's a little bit easier to compress than the Hype Fire. You gotta have a little bit more strength. But I think the consistency and the sweet spot size of the Hype Fire is just unmatched. It's so forgiving down towards the hands. But the Rollins Icon is gonna swing a little bit lighter. Um, the Hype Fire is not technically unloaded, but it definitely swings heavier than the Rollins Icon. But one of the things that I hate about the Wallings Icon is the stock grip is just not there. So we have some Vegas Gold Lizard Skin, which y'all can get at the Headbanger Sports website. And y'all can use our code BDB to save on select products. Stay tuned for more videos. Click the Headbanger Sports link in the description and use code BDB to save on select products. Which one do you think is harder? What? Which one do you think is harder?